Hello boys and girls, welcome along to the vlog. Excuse the shaky camera work, but I am out hiking with Reggie today. So it's 23 degrees and I'm out doing about a 10 mile walk. Didn't want to bring Chance, it's probably too much for him, so we've had to leave the poor pup alone unfortunately. Look at that beautiful pink hawthorn. Wow, well, just look at that. Pink and white. It's gorgeous. So I'm in the small village of Laxton, which is famous for its open field farming history. As you can see, we've got different types of crops interspersed next to each other with very few. There are occasional ones, but very few hedgerows. And it is absolutely gorgeous. I think I can just see one person down there ahead, and that's the first person I've seen since I left the village. So uh, I'll capture a shot of Laxton Parish Church when we get back, because that's beautiful. But we should be walking past Egmonton and a few other landmarks on the way as well. So I'll pick them up, provided I've got enough battery life on the camera. Well, I just couldn't resist getting the camera out for this view. So that's the track I've just walked down. And the village of Laxton is hidden away just below that ridge there. But you can see really quite far into the distance. Over there you can see Cotton Power Station. That used to be one of three power stations in the local area what was known as Megawatt Valley and then you can see across there we're going towards Egmonton and Tuxford and there is little Reggie saying hurry up dad I want to keep going but wow it's gorgeous up here I should come this way more often let me just zoom out just to give you an idea look at that isn't it great Reggie found a little stream, having a little cool off aren't you buddy, don't drink too much mate, it might be a little bit, mind you actually these fields around here are meadow, there shouldn't be too much agricultural runoff, but if you need to cool down Reg, you need to cool down don't you pal, isn't it lovely, he wants a paddle more than anything I think. <laughs> Come on then mister, let's carry on trekking. So we're about four and a half, five miles in. Walk round Laxton, um, Curtain Wood, sorry. It was absolutely beautiful. The amount of flowers that were out was uh, quite astounding to be fair. I was that taken aback by it all. I neglected to get any footage. Oh well, there's always next time. Oh, look, Penfold. He wants more water now. <laughs> this stream's following us along here. Rest just wants to go in. Bless him. He keeps. Uh, Jumping into the dike now, he's found the water. He wants to walk down there where it's wet. And I have to walk down with the sun on my back, don't I boy? Come on then. Go oh, boy. I don't think he's ever had as much fun. You coming up? <laughs> He's a nutter. Into the village of Egmonton. Reggie, stop pulling me arm, you nutcase. So we've just had to walk down the road for 25 minutes. So uh, Reggie's feet might be getting a little bit hot, but he's not. Re he's refusing to walk on the grass for some reason. So this is Egmonton 
parish church. What a lovely looking church it is too. Let's have a look what's in the on the notice board in terms of opening times. Oh, they are back open Sunday the 7th of June. Bands to call. I do love these buildings. I'm not so much interested in the uh, malarkey that goes on inside them, however. But the buildings themselves are absolutely gorgeous. Let's have a walk around. The old gravestones. 1972. Oil storage, fuel, isn't it absolutely lovely? Now there's a Mott and Bailey around here somewhere as well, which I'm not familiar with. I don't know where it is. I don't know if you can even visit it. I might go on the hunt. Oh, what a beautiful building. And a graveyard on the other side it would appear. Well we've decided to take a little bit of shelter under the shade of a mighty oak tree in the middle of a field just uh, south of Edmonton and then we're going to follow the yellow post down there past that water truck or whatever container and then to the right down that lane back into Laxton my water's run out and I've only got a third of a bag of Bombay mix left that should see us through Reggie I think this would have spent chance to be honest and maybe next time I'll bring well there's plenty of streams for Reggie to drink out of to be fair I was thinking bring him some proper clean water but actually he'll be fine It'll be fine, he can drink out of the uh, few occasional water troughs that we see for the livestock. But it's bloody, bloody wonderful out here. It's bloody gorgeous, I was going to say. Bloody wonderful. So let's carry on. And in the distance there, after another mile or so, you can see the tower of Laxton Church. That is our start and finish point I'll just get a better shot of it there she is so let's uh, let's carry on well I found this lovely little sign in the middle of a field we really are on the last leg now we're just two two minutes or so away from getting back to the parish church where the car is parked on the road I just thought I'd get a shot of this, mainly so I can zoom in later on and read it, because that's really quite interesting. Never would have thought this was here, would you? Right, the footpath, I think, veers off slightly to the right, and then off into the back of the church somewhere. There's the church. I can see a yellow post at the top of the hill. Just about there. So that is where we're kind of headed. Let's do it. Well, we're almost at the top. I just thought I'd show you this house. Look at that for a statement. Isn't it wonderful? Reggie's beat me to the public footpath. Kissing gate. Must have something on his mind. It's quite a steep hill, that. You can't tell from the bottom. Oh my gosh. Let's carry on. Always through. And we've made it. Now, this is uh, Egmonton Parish Church. This is almost as big as St. Swithin's Church in Retford. It's absolutely massive. With a really ornate gargoyle atop of the tower. But wow. It's really quite huge. 
Look at this, this must be where the uh, vicars or whatever are buried from times gone by. Wow, it's massive. It's an absolutely massive church in the middle of a relatively small village. Tuxford is just a few miles away. That's a bigger village than this one. And uh, this is Laxton. Yeah, did I say Egmonton? It's Laxton. Egmonton Church is smaller than this, and I'd have said that village is a little bit bigger. But wow, it really is a monster. This is the first time I've been here in the grounds as well. So, beautiful. Right, let's go and get in the car and head back to sunny Retford. Oh, we're in sunny Laxton, so one would assume Retford will be sunny also. Not a millstone. Oh, isn't it lovely? Isn't it just ornate? Beautiful. I'll keep rolling while I walk around. But uh, I'll have to pop him on a lead if we see anybody. Oh, it's absolutely gorgeous around here. And there's the car. Come here then, Reggie. Let's get you on the lead. Well done. <laughs> 